Oh man, that armor looks so good. Anyway, I just picked up Jones from school. He wore it was wacky sock day or funny sock or crazy sock or what was it? Fun. Crazy sock. Crazy sock day. So he basically wore one of a pair of my socks. Whoa! And right now I'm heating up lunch. Oh my gosh, guys. I like left the food out last night and like I quickly put it in the fridge this morning. But have you guys ever done that? For some reason, like with the crock pot stuff, because they say to not put food, hot food in general, like into the, you know, refrigerator right away to wait until it cools down. So then I wait and then I totally forgot. And then I woke up this morning and was like a ton of like chicken from chicken tacos were in there. So we're going to just eat some more at lunch and then we'll probably have to throw it out. But, um, I just hope I don't get sick. So Brian's going to go to an eye doctor appointment. So that's what's going on. And then tonight I'm going to go film something for Melanie. Something for her one of her classes. She's Dad? she's a professor, by the way. I'm just going to her house, so maybe you'll see some from that. So we will see you later. Oh man, that armor looks so good. Hey guys, it is uh, Tuesday, and last night I was super busy. I went over to Melanie's. I didn't film anything, but well, I did film something, but not for you guys. Basically, um, she did like a bunch of interviews about um, people that grew up either born in another country and then came to America or were born in America but their parents are from another, another country, that sort of thing. So anyway, it was really interesting. It was neat like seeing like what, you know, like all these different stories I've never heard of my friends, some of them that are so hilarious. She's actually a professor um, at a college here and so she's gonna use those videos for her classes to teach about like, uh, different cultures and culture shock and so in any case I'm gonna go and edit those I made myself an omelet Ellie's on the iPad Jonah is at school is wacky hair day and I try to put his hair in like these like uh, little elastics and whatever and then he was like I didn't want that and it's like dude you have like really curly hair there's only so much I can do for you okay so I'm gonna try to edit those videos or start editing them because there's like 10 and I was like lordy I went over there about 6 30 or 7 and we didn't get done until about like 10 um, so but it was a good time and it, oh my gosh Melanie if you see this video that chili was so good she made turkey chili and it was the bomb.com so watch out Paula Dean or somebody that's what I'm gonna do yeah you like my new setup guys this is pretty much like this is I kind of I did like an Instagram uh, picture about it but pretty much this is like my current setup because we're having Danny come over he's coming over Friday he's gonna paint the inside of the house so all this is going down originally we had planned to do like a, a train like a model train because Brian's really into that but then we ended up getting really busy and we had kids and we just pretty much lost track of time. Danny's actually, I'll post a link to his uh, painting business. He is amazing. He painted our whole house. I mean, he's very, I mean, there are no words. He's just like perfection, okay? And he's also Italian, so I like him. He's my BFF. Yeah, I'll leave a link to his um, business if you live in the Atlanta area because he is, he's top notch guys like amazing tonight Brian's gonna go to storage I'm probably I don't know I may I may just go with him uh, to make a load I had to skip the gym last night we're gonna actually put Jonah's bed into storage um, I'm thinking about getting him like a different like headboard thing once we actually move and then this will probably just go on Elias bed instead and then we're gonna move her crib we're gonna take that down move that over there we're just gonna kind of rearrange this room so that it's more open. Oh my God, these blinds like don't work now. They're like jacked up. Ooh, anyway, Melanie's brother, Chris, gave us this for the kids. Ooh, ew, this cat has a diaper. What the heck? I love it. So, ew, the duck has a diaper. Barnyard babies. I thought it was cute and Elliot's gonna like it, but she's over there doing her thing. So I'm gonna try to eat, get some work done. Good news guys, I am officially going to the social shakeup here in Atlanta. Um, it's a social media conference, convention, well not convention, it's a conference. There'll be like Snapchat people, Instagram people, Twitter people, there'll be brands and all this stuff. So pretty much like the mecca of networking will 
be here in Atlanta for social media stuff. So I'm excited. Sean's actually flying over from Utah to speak at this conference. So that should be fun to get back together with him. And they blessed me with knocking off some money off of a ticket for me. I don't think I'm gonna be going to CVX Live um, just because of us moving and it's gonna be a busy year. I can at least go to this one because it's literally here in Atlanta. And then Sean's coming over here so we can hang out again. Um, and this will be a great opportunity to meet other people and to network and mingle and all that good stuff. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, like when I went to CVX, like I spent a buttload of money to fly over there. And I honestly didn't really get that much out of it. Like, yes, I saw friends. I was able to finally meet people, all that stuff. And it was great. But I sort of felt like it was, it was very like, it was geared towards like people that were like speakers and whatever. And so it's like a lot of us like smaller creators, like we weren't allowed to certain like networking things or get togethers. And I sort of feel that like when you limit things like that, like it just kind of sucks. I mean, it wasn't horrible, but it wasn't like, amazing you know who knows maybe it's up in the air maybe i'll go but right now i paid for this conference so with that being said i'm gonna get some work done because i need to get some work done i'll catch up with you guys later i don't know what we're doing probably we'll be helping move tonight um as much as i want to work out i'm actually eating really good so this week's gonna gonna be a little yeah but oh well it is what it is hey jonah Hey, Jonah, guess what? What? We're going to go on a play date on Friday. Friday? Yep, we're going to go play with somebody. Can you guess? Who? Guess. Jackson? Yes. Mm. You're going to go have a picnic at the park. I always wanted to have I'm a picnic. I was supposed to rain Friday? <laughs> you always wanted to have a picnic? Yeah. <laughs> you always say that about everything. Anyway, is that Elia? Yeah. Rise and shine, butterfly! Ah! Oh. 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 You should be in the Olympics for jumping in the crib. Is that an Olympic sport? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. She's so cute. Say bye. Oh, you're dighty? Yeah. Okay, we'll take care of that. Anyway, I'm gonna end the vlog. We just got back from taking some more stuff to storage, so that was interesting. I did a bunch of laundry because we had a chest here. We brought that to storage. We had another chest inside of this closet. We brought that to storage. Pretty much that's what's going on. So we're gonna get the kids ready for bed. We have to pick out a funny outfit for Jonah because this week is Dr. Seuss week. So they've been doing like funny sock day or funky sock day or something wacky. So I don't know what they call it. Tomorrow is like, um, I guess it's no, tomorrow's wacky Wednesday. So anyway, my guess is he has to wear something crazy. So we're gonna pick out something. But you guys have a wicked awesome night. We will see you guys again on Friday. So, yeah, we just have a lot of moving stuff to do this week. And this weekend, Jonah's going to get that cavity filled that he has. And then uh, next weekend, we have a wedding we're doing. So, we're just in the process of packing, cleaning, all that stuff. It's getting real, guys. It's getting for real. Yeah, if you have not subscribed, please click that subscribe button if you are interested in watching my life. I know some of you guys on here are new and you're like, hey, I really like watching you. Well, thank you guys. Like, thank you for the sweet compliments, like always in the comments. Like, what the heck, people? Quit being so nice. I guess question of the day would be, um, regardless of whatever day this is, what is the biggest thing you accomplished today? So. It could be just waking up. I mean, that's pretty big. So we'll see you guys later. Jesus loves you. Peace. The Y Life.